One of the big problems in, in, in any rehab is, you know, resistance to change. I mean, change comes up very hard. It's kind of funny, but uh, when I say resistance to change, you know, comes up hard, well, that's just not about our guest. You know, it, it's, it's a concept that we're all familiar with, okay? Uh, and so I would even say that a lot of rehab facilities, you know, when, when new science, new technology comes available, uh, you know, the, there's always a resistance factor in developing that new technology. Well, because we're always looking to self-improve, okay, and to do the best we can for our guests, we like to embrace, you know, evidence-based technology, something that's going to help our people. And, and so that's what we're about. And so if it comes around and, and it's shown to be successful in the work, we're going to use it. Neurofeedback, in a nutshell, helps accelerate the focus process. And so that way a person can start to understand and see what we're trying to point their way. And it helps the person to get in what athletes commonly call the zone. And that's when a person is at their optimum, if you will, best. You know, why are we consistently trying to innovate and evolve? It's for one reason and one reason only. And that's because it works.